Um, at Sebring, uh, like I said, it was no idea what, what was going to happen. And I end up after a two day, I just had a third day where I asked my, my brother again to have a little bit more time on his car. He's actually happy, so happy that I'm going to be uh, at the, the next test. I'm going to have my own car and I'm never uh, not going to bother him again. But when I turned up to Inf Infineon, it was, uh, it was a different, different feeling altogether on a track that I, I never imagined how much it would go up and down and blind turns and it was a fantastic feeling but it still it took me much more time than Sebring obviously for to to learn because of all, all that stuff uh, and uh, but I felt so good when I got out of the car and those people just shouting my name and just uh, wishing me well and there was a little conversation with uh, you know it's fantastic that the series put that in uh, you know all those thousand people there uh, putting questions up and uh, just uh, it's it's good to have the drivers doing that you feel you know they you have so many people that go there just to watch you and to tear you up so it's it's nice that you have a little feedback and i felt great i it's almost like i never done in there you could say you know i i used to enjoy so much i used to uh, i enjoy america i've um, i've spent uh, many vacations over here i came in to watch many many races uh you know from friends and so on and uh but i, I feel that i never been in it's almost a new experience i i'm coming in and like i said four corners flat out 220 some things maybe 230s you never know it's uh it's amazing i mean i'm gonna go through the rookie uh, orientation and um, you know it's a process and uh Although I, I love fast corners, I don't know what to expect. I think that you have so m little wings on the car, you're going to be so precise and uh, hopefully I will adapt very quick because it is a championship that everything counts and uh, it's brand new to me. Well, if you, if you ask me what is going to be happy for me, obviously you're going to wish for the best and, and trying to win the thing, but it's, uh, I have to be very realistic. I need to keep my feet on the ground. We have uh, people in Tony, Dario, Will, uh, you know, uh, all the Penske, you have Scott, you have, you have every, every driver that have a chance to win there. I'm, uh, I'm almost like just a rookie. I won't be 100% prepared when I get into some peat. So it's, uh, I, I want to keep my feet on the ground and do as, as good as I can. And I'm, I'm pretty sure at the end of the season when we talk again, whatever the position is, I'm going to be able to give you a note to say hey, that was a that was a, an eight or nine or a ten. I don't I, I don't expect it to be. I hope that is not below eight. So I hope uh, it's been a good season.